everyone, and welcome back to another episode of the Hot Mike Morning Show. It's back. It's back again. Another episode of Let's Watch Mori. Everything's been quite a quite a success so far with this uh, segment, so we're going to keep on doing it as long as humanly possible. Like I said, Mori is my guilty pleasure. Mori, if you're out there, I'm your biggest fan, man. I want to be on the show, but not as a... <laughs> definitely not as one of the poor souls that have a, a DNA testing issue, a lie detector test issue, something like that. I just want to be on the show, honestly. But, uh, <laughs> so, we got a brand new episode for everyone today. I'm going to be reviewing this. This is the first time I'm seeing any of these episodes, so uh, you're seeing it at the exact same time, and uh, that's it. Uh, <laughs> the exact same time I am, and uh, you're getting my, my honest reactions here to... Uh, to the show. Now, uh, my record is a little bit tarnished now. I was sort of bragging in the first episode of this uh, Let's Watch Mori about how I'm pretty well uh, perfect at guessing, you know, if the, if the guy is or isn't the father. And uh, in episode one, at least, I was like spot on, like totally guessed that one. In episode two, I was totally wrong. I was like, I, I should have seen it, of course, because, you know, Mori's... Mori knows how to how to get us thinking one thing and and then completely uh, undercut our expectations and, and completely blow us away. So <laughs> we're gonna see what's up with this episode here. And uh, yeah, the, the the title itself uh, of this episode really, it it I can tell already it's gonna be an interesting one. The title is "You're Too White to Be My Daughter." Yeah, I'll leave it at that. We'll start the episode. We'll go into our whole. Uh, we'll let Maury set the scene for us. Now, you know, as we've seen in the past, the shade of someone's skin is often the catalyst, you know, for a paternity battle. This next story on The Maury Show is a first. Everyone, please welcome Meek to The Maury Show. Now, I want to show you a picture of Meek the day she was born 36 years ago. When Meek's mother, Laverne, first laid eyes on Meek, she claimed the hospital switched her baby at birth. Oh, 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 oh my God. <laughs> oh, that baby, that baby's too white to be my baby, boy. <laughs> Back to the video. And that Meek was not her daughter. This is oh no joke. Gosh. For 36 years, Laverne has treated Meek that, like an woman, unwanted though. stranger in their own family. Watch this. I was made to feel my entire life like I did not belong, only because of my skin complexion. My mother told me that I was not her biological daughter. She claimed that I was switched at birth. Do you know how it feels to deal with that over and over again? Yes, I'm light skinned. Yes, I have hazy blue eyes and blonde hair, but I belong to my mother. Oh my gosh, okay. This this lady is definitely African American. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what the problem is here, but you know, M Maury could be pulling a little pulling a little trick here. This baby could have been changed at a young age, but this would be this would be absolutely terrible if if they switch this this girl out at birth. Like what the hell? I don't know. I don't know what to think right now. I'm just very interested to see where this is going to go. It is a rare case. We have given Meek and Laverne a maternity oh test. My goodness. To see if, in fact, Meek was switched at birth. First of all, hi, Maury. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. That was great. In any situation, if I ended up on the Maury show, that's the first thing I would say. I'd be like, hey, Maury, I love you. <laughs> I don't know. I picture it sort of going down. Oh. I picture it going down something sort of like this. I love you, Maury. I ain't never stopped loving you, Maury. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. We're going to get right back into this. I'm going to get that out of the way. But I need everybody to understand that she is going crazy. I am her daughter. <laughs> I've been her daughter. Look at that. That's a crazy lady right there. I've been her daughter. She needs to realize that. Okay, so let's go back. You're I, I want to show. What the? <laughs> what? A, 
<laughs> what a bitch. What a bitch. Oh, my God. Like, <laughs> you, you're not my child. You're I, I not sh- my child. <laughs> this is crazy. Honestly, I'm going to feel, like, really terrible if she actually is not this lady's child. Laverne seems like a real, real bad person, though. Like, obviously you gave birth to a baby, even though she's, like, a little bit lighter skinned. She's still obviously black. Your mother's been throwing this picture in your face all your life. Yes, she have, Maury. Yeah, so and what, what did she say? She said, I belong to a white man. <laughs> she said, yes. She said, I've been switched at birth. I'm not her child. I don't look like her. I don't act like her. I don't look like nobody in the family. And that's how you grew up. Just like that. It's bad enough I had to hear it from outsiders. Growing up at school, right. going to work, people asking me, is I mixed? No, I'm black. Just like my mother. Like, it, it pains me to think, like, what, what was this girl's life been, like, growing up? Obviously, like, this is terrible. Like, this crazy lady denying that she's her daughter? Like, does this... I, I want to know, does this Laverne lady have other children? And is she doing the same thing to other children? Is she denying that her children are her children? I I'm need gonna... my real child! <laughs> you... <laughs> Sorry to cut in again, but there's a definitely a potential here for a, a follow-up show for Maury. If... if this is indeed not Laverne's child, then they need to go and find Laverne's child. Like, who did she get switched with at birth? Like, are there... Is there a, a, a mixed couple somewhere that has a really dark baby? I look just like you, boo No, you don't! Yes, you're I do. Child. Whatever. I want to show you a picture of everybody, of you in the third grade, and your mother Y'all, in the third come grade. Y'all, Y'all. Okay, we got this is my favorite ass. part here now, and I gotta, I gotta get my rep back up because I'm, I'm one for two right now, which honestly, if you'd seen me lifetime, obviously I'm like, probably like a hundred for a hundred and one. Like that, that last one was probably the only one that that second video there is probably the only video that I've ever been wrong about if if someone is the the father or not, and now this one we're just totally. They're throwing balls to the wall, and we're doing a maternity test instead. I'm gonna say though, I gotta, I gotta look hard, but it, look, the ears are the same. You look at the ears; the ears are the same. The eyebrows are the same. The forehead is the same. the The face looks rather, rather similar. The 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 part where it gets a little bit more difficult is they've got sort of a different facial expression in in the picture right like the the mom's sort of going like and and the daughter's sort of going like so <laughs> there's a little bit of a different facial expression going on there but um you know the shape of the eyes uh look very similar the nose uh it's it's hard to tell because of the lighting i think but the nose looks a little similar definitely the ears are spot on uh you could almost maybe see a little bit more of a similarity between the look on her face right now versus that that picture of her mother. So I'm I'm very interested to see for this one. So yeah, Laverne is backstage and, and Laverne is furious. Come on, bring out Laverne. She doesn't bring believe that Meek is her real daughter. She thinks her real daughter is out there somewhere. Everybody, here's Laverne. that end up on Maury, they're obviously not there for a great reason, but uh, <laughs> like I said, honestly if I ended up on Maury, I'd be like, first thing I would tell Maury is, Maury, I love you. Like, <laughs> I'm glad to be here, man. Even though I would, if I were in that situation, I probably wouldn't be that glad to be there, you know? She's denying this child that I child am is, done. That's it's over with that. Exactly. After we get these tenses back and everybody see that I'm your daughter, she and I'm your child that I belong to you, on. I don't want to hear it no more. Well, you know what? I am so sorry that I 
defend you for 36 years. How do you think I feel to look at you and know oh I cannot God. make blonde hair, blue eyed yes, baby? Oh my God. I can't make it. I am black. I am black. I am black too. No, you I'm not. just a lighter bird. Oh, 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 oh. You, can, you cannot go and tell somebody who's black that they're not black. I guarantee you, you did a DNA test, that lady would come up as at least 75% African. Like, <laughs> at the end of the day, if they did switch kids, it still shouldn't matter. She raised me. Everybody still ain't getting the bigger picture. The bigger picture is a me. Stealer. When I born a girl in this world, and I do that, and then to see that five, do you know how they carry me for No, it's about years? me. It is about me. No, it's, it's about, about you. me. No, it's about me, because you deny me. Like, imagine the, the, the mental toll that that takes on a person. Your mother doesn't even believe that you're her child. She thinks that you got switched out at birth and that you're a white man's baby or something. Or a white woman's baby. Like, <laughs> that's crazy. These two don't look very impressed either. Did you go try to prove that, that she was switched at birth? Oh. They was gonna put me in jail. They was gonna lock me up. They made me leave and I wouldn't take her home. Her father would. Cause they was gonna lock me up. Because I wanted my child. You don't think that you all look alike? Morby, come on now. You ain't blind. You got glasses <laughs> on. Let's Actually, get real. <laughs> he's got glasses on. Probably because he's not blind, but he needs he needs them to see, obviously. <laughs> Honestly, though, you think about it, and it's like, it's not completely beyond the realm of possibility that her daughter could have lighter eyes, right? Because the blue eyes, for example, is a recessive gene. The brown eyes is the dominant gene. But if, if she were a carrier at some point, like if there was uh, uh, somehow the gene, and there's all sorts of other genes that like work on uh, on a level of like, you know, changing eye color and hair color and that sort of thing. So it's not beyond the realm of possibility that this is her child. I'm like very much in the column of thinking that she's definitely her daughter and this lady's just crazy. It ain't none of y'all blind, so stop your acting. You know me and this girl don't look nothing alike. Nothing. Mom, let's be for real. Y'all, come on now. Yeah. If you open up that paper, and I'm not the mother, you better have an ambulance here to tote me out. And that's straight up. If, yeah, if you open that paper, and it turns out that she ain't not my daughter, how are you going to get an ambulance to take me out of here? Like, <laughs> I would, I'd need an ambulance too if I found out my child was switched at birth. That's crazy. But like, the, the, I, I think the odds are stacked against her. But you gotta, you gotta remember this is the the Maury Povich show. So the chances are that the, maybe, maybe this girl has been switched at birth. Like, I, I don't want to say it. I don't want to like, like I also don't want to jinx it. But I'm, I'm like. The final guess here, before the DNA results come out, I'm thinking 100%, this is her daughter. She's just a real terrible woman. Oh, oh baby, the DNA test results are in. Best part of the show right here. <laughs> That's my favorite part. In the case of 36-year-old Meek, Laverne, you are the mother! I told you. Honestly, I don't think I even had to tell you. Like this, this lady's just crazy. That the chances that someone will get switched at birth like that, like that, that doesn't happen, right? That's not a thing. Pretty sure that's not a thing. So, like once again, you know, Maury never ceases to surprise us. I thought, you know, maybe he had a little something up his sleeve for a second there. I thought maybe they did get switched at birth or something. But what's going to happen to poor Laverne? If Meek is not her daughter, like <laughs> she's gonna, she gonna need an ambulance to get out of there. If you open up that paper, and I'm not the mother, you better have an ambulance here to tote me out. But uh, no, very happy for the two of them, obviously, that they uh, are reconciled there. That's a, a happy ending, I suppose. But that's just terrible that 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 mom treated her daughter like that for so many years. Told her she was albino, like. <laughs> So, like, if she's albino, doesn't that mean she's still your daughter, even if she is an albino? Leave a like for, uh, obviously I got the answer right for this one. Leave a like for that. Comment, you know, were you correct to? Did you think that Maury would pull the wool over our eyes again, or, or uh, subvert expectation, that sort of thing? And uh, subscribe. 
Honestly, it helps me if you subscribe. If you hit the notification bell, it helps you out too because you get a notification every time that I upload a new video. And obviously you want to keep on watching. You want to know the next time a Let's Watch Mori comes out. Because let's be real here. This is a great series. Am I right or am I right? Okay, I'll see you all next time. And uh, keep it real. Mm -hmm.